Columbia Police. Columbia Public Schools rather held a demonstration at Hickman High School this morning to test out a new security system. ABC 17's Ethan Hines went to that demo this morning to learn more about this system and tonight joins us live in Columbia. Ethan, this system isn't a metal detector but rather a system specifically looking for weapons. Megan, that's exactly right. It isn't a metal detector. This system was built by a company called Evolve and is used to locate very specific elements of a firearm, including a slide or a barrel of a gun. Now, it is using pre-programming images, sizes, dimensions, things like this, to track certain things that are very notable on a firearm, whether it's the density of a material, the size, or the shape. The demonstration this morning was held as students made their way into Hickman High School to start their day. The touchless system scans people as they walk through the two pillars, sending pictures of a person with a locator icon to a screen, which security officials are monitoring. It's a mobile system, which is one of the things that we were also um, interested in. So we can move it throughout the building. If there are different things that are happening, we can also move it outdoors. I tried out the system for myself this morning. That is me right there. My pockets filled with cell phones, keys, and camera batteries and a prop gun given to me by officials. The system pinpointed where the mock handgun was hidden on my body. The system is subscription based for four years and would cost roughly $2,000 for each unit per month. CPS is looking to use these systems or one like them in their high schools. We are only looking at it now for our three comprehensive high schools. So that would be Hickman, Rockbridge and Battle High School. The district already has in place a multi-layer security system, including locked doors, buzz-ins, security personnel, and cameras. These detectors would act as another security layer in the school system. It's a really delicate balance, I think, right? We're all concerned about safety. We're also very concerned that this continues to feel like a school. Now, CPS, excuse me, CPS has not made a final decision on whether to go with Evolve or not. They are also looking into other companies as well. Right now, the school board hasn't heard about anything to vote on. Reporting from Columbia, Ethan Hines, ABC 17 News. Ethan, thank you so much for that report tonight. According to Evolve's website, their products are used by a number of professional sports teams, including St. Louis' professional soccer club, the Cleveland Browns, and the Boston Red Sox.